Yo, Eric. Where'd Talon go, dog? I don't know. Yo, Talon! What? What are you doing? Talon! You look like a rock from here. Stand up and wave. YouTube, what's going on? If you're new here, my name is Roger. I own a company called QBO Tactical where we make holsters and gear and also some content for this channel. As you can see from the intro, our buddy Talon was here in town. Uh, it's been a crazy week and weekend. He got here, uh, what is it? I think like Wednesday, hung out for the weekend. Uh, had to fly back home for some stuff, but he'll be back. Uh, we've been working away here in the shop. Des, handling orders and emails. Yep. Got Matt over here. This is kind of weird because he's like editing the vlog that you're watching right now. Inception, right? <laughs> um, let's go outside to the shop, see what the guys are up to. Uh, it's the night crew now, it's just about 6 p.m. So, orders, dangerous, dangerous pink box donuts, but orders here. Aaron's prepping stuff up, Compton's prepping stuff up. Got the week off from the That's day right. job, so he's here to help out, get that week time down. That's right. What's up, Fitz? What's up? When are you gonna get back on the range, bro? Next time we go, I'm, I'm done. What about you, Aaron? I don't know, hopefully soon. Yeah. Yo, are you wearing, our, I think Aaron's wearing our new Tiger Stripe. Uh... By American Eagle. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, working away. Um, for those of you who aren't familiar, like our lead time is about eight weeks and we run the shop from 10.30 a.m. to 9 p.m. Monday through Thursday. Fridays we cut work at five and normally do some type of dinner or hangout, stuff like that. But anyway, check out this footage. Um, we went and visited Mike at Ventura Munitions, of course. There's an update for you guys that are local here in Vegas with the ammo shortages and stuff like that. Uh, we also then go visit Rifle Dynamics where, uh, coincidentally, Mike's brother Nick works. So, but awesome stuff. Got to uh, hang out at a local uh, Las Vegas business that manufactures AK-47s. Uh, they do a lot of other things too, but Rifle Dynamics, um, super cool company. Um, their marketing director, Eric, we actually found out that him and I went to high school together, so that was kind of cool. But anyways, check out the video. Um, yeah, enjoy. Hello. What up? Where are we going, dog? Going to a place where they sell guns, and then to a place where they make guns, and then and then Costco. Knows. Costco, <laughs> yeah, probably. All right. What's up, man? What's, What's up? going on, Walt? What's happening? How are you, sir? What's up, man? What's up, dude? Nothing, man. How you feeling, man? A little tired? Yeah. A little tired? Kind of, kind of bruised up. I don't know what that's gonna look like. <laughs> but good. Overall, solid. Any uh, any updates for the Ventura peeps, the customers? Uh, we're getting more guns in, and those are all ARs, Woo! AR pistols. Uh, ammo still sucks. But supposed to be by the end of the week or end of the month, we're supposed to get flooded with nine millimeter. So. Fingers crossed, that's a good thing, at least the more. But nice. Other than that, business as usual. California still no mags. Still can't send them yet? Still can't send them. So, but we've been burning through a lot because, you know, people travel. It happens. Gotcha. But no. Chilling. Cool, man. Appreciate the update. Yeah, thanks for coming. From one Goyak. Now we're going to go see the other. <laughs> Boom. Hey, look at this guy. Like I said, from one Goyak to another. This is Nick. You guys might remember him. Previously of Ventura and now of Rifle Dynamics. Hey, -o. it's May case. What you got there, buddy? Uh, this is one of our 704 SBRs. I like that one a lot. Well, Super modern, modern looking. Yeah. Pretty so they're setting up for a builder's class here. This is super cool. Kind of break down this program because I thought it was very interesting when you explained it to me. So the way this works is usually we do just your standard AKM builds, uh, but this is going to be our first pistol build. So customers are going to come in, uh, they more or less start with a bunch of parts and essentially they completely assemble the, the pistol. So going from pushing rivets to put place on the Ultimac, uh, just building the entire gun. Uh, it's a two day course, it's pretty cool. Uh, first day mostly you do assembling and then the second day get out to the range, get to shoot the gun that you build, which I think is awesome. I got to take the class, it's one of the most fun experiences of my life. And then you come back in and you do a history lecture. So you get to go from where the AK started all the way until the modern modern production rifles uh, that they're using Russia and then kind of what we're doing with our modern AKs. That is so much better than just getting an instruction manual with the, with the gun. Hell yeah. 
Yeah, no, it's, it's fun. It's a really good class. Eric, what's yep. going on, man? What's up, man? Hey. So this is Eric, kind of in charge of marketing for Rifle Dynamics, running the show here. Um, breakdown, like, are there gonna be a bunch of these? Like, what's the class schedule looking like for this? The class schedule is pretty much filled out for this year. We have one more class. It's a, our milled gun class, so you basically build up a milled pistol or a milled rifle. It's kind of cool. Uh, it's a little bit different. Mill guns are a little bit heavier, but they have. You were nice saying the pistol classes are the new ones coming up. Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. So, so the the milled uh, pistol, milled rifle. It's a little bit different than our stamp receivers, but uh, Sean Sharp will be in that class. He's the guy who makes the NB47 receivers. Nice. That you'll be building, building on, and um, I think after that we are working our 2020 one schedule which includes uh, Thunder Ranch. We're gonna have some Thunder Ranch classes in the very beginning, but we're also developing some other classes, which may be more pistol classes, more AKM classes, and maybe a classic class where you get to work with some wood. Nice, um, man, super cool. Yeah. I know you're breaking down the history lesson for me. Oh yeah. Real quick, man, show them that Call of Duty PKM up there. Oh, this guy right here. All right, so everybody kind of knows this guy. It's kind of been around, been, um, been in video games like Call of Duty. Uh, it's a 760 by 54 r uh, general purpose machine gun. This one's kind of set up with all the Zenico stuff, all the Russian stuff you see probably in, um, what's that game? Tarkov? Yeah, Escape from Tarkov. Escape from Tarkov. Escape from Tarkov, yeah. It's kind of cool. We're going to be taking this guy out tonight and shoot some uh, night vision stuff with a clip on uh, night vision and uh, see how it goes. But uh, it's pretty good. This one's a little bit heavier because of all the Zenico stuff, but usually these guys are like 17 pounds. So gotcha. it's pretty light for a GPM. And uh, 54R is basically like 30 out 6. So nice, man. Yeah. Sweet, dude. I appreciate you showing us around, man. Definitely look forward to doing some more stuff. Definitely. Awesome. Thanks. Yo, so all of those wondering why the uh, ADS speed in Warzone is so slow on the PKM, watch this. Go for it. Because this thing weighs like 50 pounds. Uh, so that thing is nuts. <laughs> See how long you hold it out for. All right, guys, that is going to do it for this video. I appreciate you guys checking out the video. If you're new to the channel, consider subscribing because we post new videos every week. Um, if you want to support our content, check out the Patreon link down below. Our Patreon members, our Patreon squad, they are a big reason why we can continue to create the content that we do, so we really appreciate them. Um, and as always, guys, I will see you in the next video.